everybody, Pam with Normalized Cloth. I wanted to do a quick video talking about are diaper rash ointments cloth diaper safe? So this comes up a lot. A lot of people want to know, can I use that thing with zinc oxide in it? Can I use that stuff that has petroleum in it? Or va can I use Vaseline? Or can I make my own homemade ointments and such? And or can I use specialized things on my diapers and do they need special treatment and do they need special washing? Simply put, yes. You can pretty much use any cloth diaper ointment with your cloth diapers. But you do have to take some special care if you do depending on what you use. For the most part, it's pretty much safely assumed that you can use anything you want so long as you use it in conjunction with a liner. Now you can use disposable liners or you can cut and make your own out of uh, micro fleece or um, you can even use a cloth wipe as a barrier of some kind as long as you have something between the baby's bum and the diaper itself. Now the thing is, and what I learned from a Thirsty's Live video actually, is that things that are petroleum based, like a &D ointment or just Vaseline, you can use those actually right up against natural fiber diapers. And so long as you're using a synthetic detergent that is not a plant-based detergent, you can use it, uh, wash it on hot with your regular detergent, you know, Tide will suffice or Gain or most mainstreams that aren't plant-based, and they will actually wash it completely out of the fibers no issues. However, if I'm using something like a and with like a pocket diaper that's synthetically lined with like its own micro fleece or micro suede, I might just use a disposable or reusable insert anyways. Just because I sort of feel like better safe than sorry. Honestly, with having micro fleece liners, I've never had issues getting any diaper ointment out of them. And they don't have repelling, they don't have issues, so honestly, you could probably just use them with those diapers too. And it'll probably wash out of the lining just like it would wash out of these liners. Same thing is true with most like coconut oil based or homemade rash ointments. Like most of the stuff and some of these um, ones you can buy, like like this is colloidal oatmeal skin protectant. Like you, these will wash out of the diapers. You don't even honestly need any kind of barrier on there, any kind of liner, unless you have a diaper that is made out of microfiber. Microfiber and any kind of oils or ointments and such really don't mix. If I was using any kind of rash ointment with those diapers, I would most definitely line the diaper. Even if it has some kind of lining on top, you definitely want to line it with something because I would want it to be as separated as possible. Microfiber is just a really absorbent material and it's really hard to get things out of it once it's in it. So if you get something like oils in there, it can take some serious washing and even stripping to get all of that stuff out. If you wanna have a diapering system that is for the most part safe with virtually any cloth diaper ointment you can use, stick to natural fiber diapers. And if you don't feel comfortable putting them up against your diapers, just get some liners, make some liners. You know, this was a couple bucks. I bought a couple bucks worth of material and chopped out some liners. Cloth wipes can work too as a liner in a pinch. You're only, you only need something as a barrier for where the ointment is. One comment about zinc oxide, anything with zinc oxide in it can stain your diapers. And so a lot of people will line those diapers purely because they don't want staining. And those can be some pretty stubborn stains. So the key thing is, can you use diaper rash creams with your cloth diapers? Yes, but ideally, it should be natural fiber diapers, not microfiber. Use liners if you don't feel comfortable having them going in direct contact with your diapers. It's a lot nicer to just have to throw this away than something else, but I can tell you now I've never had to throw one of these away. Make sure that your detergent is synthetic, that is not plant-based, and make sure you wash on hot. And honestly, given that your wash routine and your diapers all fall into that curriculum, feel free to use whatever the heck works for you. Whether you hand make it, buy it, use it. Zinc oxide, just be cautious. It can stain your diapers. If you're worried about repelling or anything, I've used everything from coconut oil to petroleum based products to just homemade rash creams. I've never had an issue. That's with lining them or not lining them. I hadn't, like I said, I haven't even had issues with my liners and zinc oxide for the record has never stained my liners either, but they can stain your natural fibers. So that's the short and sweet answer. If you have any questions or if you have any other experience with it, let me know in the comments below. Like this video if it helped you. So thank you for watching and have a blessed day.